What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Dr. DDub here, and welcome back to Stardew Valley. And man, it actually feels incredibly nice to say that. I just had a little bit of a panic. I could not get Stardew Valley to launch for the life of me. I tried opening it from Steam, from right-clicking it in Steam and clicking play, from the desktop shortcut I had, from the actual executable file. I, I could not, for the life of me, get it to work, and it terrified me. Um, I thought everything was lost. I tried running it without the beta, with the beta. I made sure I had the most recent update. It was very frightening. But anyway, we have some progress on our fields here, and things are now harvestable. One of my goals for today is to finish out this field. Um, so we're going to... Actually, we might be able to do that right here, right now. Maybe? I'm not sure. Actually, no, because we're going to have to replant some of what we just lost. But one of my goals for today is to finish this field, like, completely. Uh, so that once it's done, we should be able to just harvest what we have each day, replant it, and then any excess will be what we end up selling, which we should have quite a bit of excess. I think we only need 20, 20 more seeds to be able to finish out that whole area. But once we get that, oh man, we're gonna be, we're gonna be in business, guys. Um, I think I'm gonna be done with, with with making some jams or pickled goods for the time being, because all of our ingredients are up at uh, our refrigerator in our house. Uh, so we can cook some more. But anyway, let me go ahead and take care of our animals, and I'll be right back. All right, today we're going to take care of something that I am kind of excited to do. Ooh, is that what we needed? I think it is. Or at least one of what we needed. Anyway, um, I'm getting way too excited for finding forageable goods. But anyway, uh, one thing we're going to take care of today is upgrading our watering can. Um, we're going to do it after... Uh, we get... Hold on. We're doing gold now, right? I believe all of our tools are... Steel? Yes, okay. So we're on, on to gold now. Uh, I believe gold's the next upgrade. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna do that. But first, we need to finish all of uh, the forageable good field that we've got going on. So that way, we can water them today. Uh, so I'm gonna go hoe the earth just randomly, find one more snow yam, and we should be able to complete that field. Ta-da! It's done! Finally! That took entirely too long. We had a couple extra winter seeds that we can use uh, for our next harvest, or once we have our next harvest. But yeah, I think that looks nice, and it's going to help make us a ton of money. But let me go ahead and do a little bit of inventory management and drop all of our stuff off, and then we'll go pay Clint a visit. And also, while I was out getting... Um, what are they called? While I was out, sorry, uh, hoeing the ground for... Snow yams, which we don't have any of because those were the limiting factor in making those seeds. Uh, but while we were out doing that, we found two more books. So I want to make a visit to the library as well and go ahead and do a little bit of reading as well. Okay, let's head over to Clint's and get our watering can upgrade graded. Wow, I can't talk. Uh, and one thing that I forgot about and I'm just now remembering is remember the, the favor that was asked of us? Uh, by Clint. Sebastian's birthday is tomorrow. We'll try to remember that. Uh, to give, and I think it was an amethyst, to Emily. And then when we did, she kissed us on the cheek and thought it was from us. And yeah, I don't know if there's any dialogue we get from Clint about that after the fact. So I'm hoping that when we go talk to him, which I'm glad we're getting here when we are, he closes in 20 minutes. But hopefully, if we can talk to him, let's get this upgraded first. Gold watering can. That's going to be... Ooh, I'm looking forward to that. I want to do this now just so we have it come spring. We won't be using our watering can probably anymore this season, but I'm looking forward to it. If you want me to upgrade your tools, you have to give me the correct ore. No? Nothing about... Clint, dude, your, your woman kissed me. I'm trying to be a good a good friend here and tell him what happened, but apparently he doesn't care. Also, today's a good luck day, and if we check these trash cans, we should be getting some goodies, maybe, or at least there's a chance of it, maybe not. A broken CD. Yes, definitely, definitely all the goodies. Uh, but we've got a couple things we can donate as well. We found these all in a cluster down in the uh, Cinder Snap Forest last episode, but these are all kind of 
fossilized looking things. This is like an arrowhead, so we'll put this over here, I guess. And then that goes there as well. Man, the museum, museum is really coming together, guys. We need one more dwarf scroll, and then I don't really know what else is out there. There's a ton of different stuff. But I'm sure some of it only comes from different... Uh, from the Skull Cavern, which is a mine we don't have access to yet, I think. Anyway, note from Gunther. Wow, this library has really become great. Thanks to your help. Thanks a bunch. That was... Yeah, you, you couldn't have just told me that, Gunther? Come on, man. Oh, yes, this is the one I've been waiting for. Secrets of the Legendary Fish. Fishermen speak of five rare and unique fish that can only be caught by skilled anglers. Once caught, they will never appear again. The crimson fish lives in the warm ocean waters of summer. It's been sighted on the far eastern side of the beach. I think this is from the, the pier, I think, on the eastern side. The glacier fish, which only appears in winter, can be caught off the southern tip of Arrowhead Island in Cinder Snap Forest, near where the river meets the ocean. We might try that, maybe even today, guys. That could be really cool. I know exactly where that's at. Um, the angler fish has been spotted in fall north of town where the river flows down from the mountains. North of town where the river flows down from the mountains. I don't know where that would be at. And then there's a rumor of a strange twisted fish that lives in the sewer. Interesting. So we've got fall, winter, and summer. No spring one? Oh, just kidding. Maybe. No, hold on. The final fish of a species never before caught is known simply as legend. It is rumored that he lives in a log submerged in the mountain lake and only ventures out on rainy spring days to nibble at the frog's eggs. Only the most skilled fishermen can hope to catch this one. Training or Train at fishing and be persistent, and eventually you will catch these elusive fish. Make sure to respect the water and don't remove too many fish from the ecosystem. Cool. The winter one. I know exactly where that's at. We might try to get that, guys. Saw something weird in the tunnel leading out from Pelican Town. There's a little door hidden in the dark. Couldn't get it open, though. Gunther. I'm pretty sure that's the, the little lockbox that we've already looked at. And now we have the task of putting Beats in Lewis's fridge from, what was it, Mr. Key, I think. I think that's who it was. I don't know. And Beats, I think, are one of the new uh, plants that become available in year two. But okay, what's our inventory situation looking like? Let's... Oh. Dang, we can't get there in time. I was going to say, let's stop by... Actually, can we craft one? Um, have we made anything that gives us plus anything to fishing? This doesn't tell us what I want to know. Uh, let's head back to the farm real quick and check and see if we can create... Actually, no, hold on. Since we're in town, let me go ahead and take care of something that... I found out, uh, I played around a little bit after last episode. You guys remember, I realized that the, uh, which one was it? One of the secret notes, 19. This is clearly Jody's house, but I was treating those arrows down there as one direction. Uh, it is one direction, but it's not just a step in that direction. I actually followed this and found where it leads. I haven't done anything with it yet though, so that'll still be new. Uh, but this is actually just continue in that direction until you can't anymore. So that's how these work. So it's left up, right up. So if we start at Jody's front door, go left, up, right, up. And we stop right here. And then this is kind of annoying because we're going to have to keep checking. <laughs> but left up, right up. And then right down, left down, right Wow, this is a long walk here. I don't know what this is going to lead us to. Right, down, left, down. And then last but not least, left, down, left, down. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Solid gold Lewis. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Can we just place this? That's hilarious. Why is that a thing? 
Loomis, why do you have a gold statue of yourself? Oh, man. That's cool. Okay, what was the other one we had? I know we had two of those. Um, okay, so that's in the desert. We've done this one. And then this. Um, I haven't seen that, so we'll we'll hold off on that. Uh, am I dumb? Is this is this that? It kind of looks like it, but kind of not. It's sort of reddish brown. Is that a thing? Let's try it. Okay, so right down. This is a long one. Right down. Right up. Right. Okay, we made it. Driver, hey kid, I need a lucky break. Why don't why don't you bring me a rabbit's foot? I'll make it worth your while. Sure. Come back when you got a rabbit's foot on you, kid. Weird. Okay. Yeah, that's really strange. These are cool though. I'm really liking these uh secret notes. At least that kind? They're like scavenger hunts, but that's really cool. I didn't think we were going to be able to do that one, but apparently we are. Also, I don't even remember where I left Applejack right now. So we're going to just, I guess, do the rest of the day on foot? At, where where are you at, Applejack? Oh, no. Bye, bye, Jody's. Okay, we're good. Let's go see if... I mean, we've got four hours and we've got energy, but we're... Do you guys see that? This this beta is very, very, very buggy. I think I've submitted almost a dozen different bugs like that. Your horse's feet stop. Your horse disappears when you transition between zones. The hoe thing. It's like Mokman, no hands, but with a hoe. It's very, very weird. Anyway, um, let's check and see. I'm pretty sure we have a fishing recipe that gives us plus fishing somewhere um yes no maybe no we have one that gives us farming so never mind we won't attempt this tonight but i would really like to attempt to catch that tomorrow which i think will be really cool but i'm gonna just do some fishing in the mountains maybe chop a little bit of wood and i'll meet you guys back in our house when it's time for bed all right let's go to bed i went ahead and placed our gold lewis statue Again, no idea why that's a thing, but I went ahead and placed it on our porch, and I don't know. It's kind of weird, kind of creepy that he would make that of himself. I don't know, but I guess that's new to the beta since it's part of uh, the secret note chain. But anyway, today is going to be a good day because it's beautiful and sunny tomorrow, and today we have very bad luck. So never mind. I always check these reruns just in case there's something I missed. I don't know if it still says it's a rerun if you've already watched it. If any of you know, let me know. But anyway, today we've got a couple things I want to take care of. Uh, we need a little bit more money to do one of those things. So we might have to do a little fishing and then head to Pierre. Or not Pierre's because he's closed. Uh, to Willie's. But I'm starting to make some more gold bars here because we didn't even have enough for another uh, tool upgrade. Which I would like to do here... Pretty much as soon as we get uh, our watering can back. D-Dub, I'm really glad you've become part of our community. I've enclosed a 500 gold check from the Stardew Valley Agricultural Fund to help you continue your good work. Maybe you can buy some more seeds with it. Sincerely, Mr. Lewis. Thank you, Lewis. Much appreciated, sir. All right, let's grab this pale ale and get another one going. I don't know what Sebastian likes. Um, I really have no clue. But we'll check our list real quick and see if there's anything he does like. Again, I'm not sure if I even have anything for him, but uh, let me check real quick. Okay, well, I know he likes sashimi, which is something we can actually make really easy. I think it's just any fish. It's as simple as that. So let me go ahead and, again, take care of all of our animals. And then we might see about making some sashimi to give to Sebastian for his birthday. Okay, guys, something I just noticed. I went ahead and checked our community center bundle progress uh, during that little break. And I've noticed we're extremely close to getting our greenhouse. Uh, for completing the pantry, that's our reward, the greenhouse. 
We are waiting on Daphne to become an adult so she can produce us some goat milk, which we can make into goat cheese. And it'll be a little while until she produces any, but we're waiting on some large goat milk and we'll be done. So Daphne, come on, girl. We're waiting on you. <laughs> we need you to grow up and make us some milk ASAP. Uh, we should have grabbed some fish. Just kidding. We already have some fish in here. That works out perfectly. Let's make some sashimi. Perfect. And then if if Willie's open today, I don't remember what days he's closed, but I would really like to stop by his place and grab a, uh, what's it called? Trout soup? Whatever gives you plus fishing. And see if we can't catch the legendary fish. Uh, what is it called? Glacier fish, I think. And I'll show you guys the exact location to do that if you're not aware. But did you guys see that? The horse just kind of disappeared. Next time we transition between zones on our horse, pay attention to that. It's kind of very annoying. Uh, I guess we'll start by hunting down uh, Sebastian. I'm going to totally forget or not even forget. Half the time I try to go, you know, give someone a gift on their birthday. I have full intent of finding them that day. Well, I say half the time. Uh, but on the days that I do remember to do it, I don't end up finding them. Like, they're either in their room all day, or... Which better not be the case, Sebastian. Dang it. I hope he gets out of bed. That's gonna suck otherwise. Oh, man. Hi there, Robin. Daydreaming about new carpentry projects. Okay, let's... Well, since that's not happening, uh, let's head down to Willie's, see about getting some trout soup, I think it's called, and then we might see if we can't catch that legendary fish. All right, Willie. Trout soup gives us plus one fishing for, I don't know how long, but hopefully one will be enough. Also, what kind of spinner are we using? Um, the one that, the hook? There's one that... Or no, sorry, not spinner. I read this. What kind of tackle are we using? Um, I really like the one that uh, decreases the speed at which you lose the fish when you're not on it, if that makes any sense. Uh, treasures, no. Bite rate, slow weak fish. That's not going to work at all. This could be nice. Slightly increases the size of your fishing bar. Let's buy one of those. And I think that's it. Yeah, this is the one I was talking about. Fish uh, Causes fish to escape slower when you aren't reeling them in. Uh, we can only use one at a time, and we already bought the cork one. So I guess we'll try using that. But let's head over to the location in Cindersat Forest of the legendary glacier fish and see if we can't catch that. All the conditions, I think, are pretty right, minus our luck today. Not that that should matter. But we've got max level fishing. A max level fishing pole with a rod with bait and a bobber, or sorry, a tackle. And I'm just hoping that's enough. And we're going to eat the trout soup to up our fishing skill. <laughs> What'd she say? Bring me a coffee? Uh, that's an expensive gift, Haley. Not for you, girl. Not for you. They really need to fix that bug. <laughs> All right. Last gift, Jody. What what do I do for fun? Hmm, that's a good question. I like sleeping. I am totally on board with that, Jody. I love sleeping too. I slept entirely too long last night. But anyway, in Cinder Snap Forest here, let's head down to what do they call it? Arrowhead Island, I think it was what it's called. It's not far away, it's just this island. Not here, but the second island. It's the one over here on the left. This is Arrowhead Island, which makes sense because it's shaped like an arrowhead facing to the left. And this is the southern tip of that island. Oh, man. Okay. I guess it's going to be located like right here. Let's down the trout soup. And I'm just going to cut to it whenever we find it. Hopefully we can catch this thing. Oh my gosh, this is it. The fish even looks slightly different. Holy crap. This thing moves so freaking fast. Uh, 
I really hope we can catch this. This is gonna be quite the struggle. <laughs> oh my gosh. Holy crap, how are you supposed to catch this? If I, if I can get this thing on the first try, that'd be awesome. Oh my gosh, that's difficult. That's just gonna take a couple tries of... Oh, and we're back to round two, or attempt number two already. <laughs> Holy crap! How are you supposed to catch that? That is insane! I don't know how you do that. I like how the fish looks different, though. That's kind of cool. Like, this is clearly not it. One, it's not putting up a fight. And two, it's... Yeah. It's, it's easy. But, oh my gosh. Um, I'm going to keep trying for a little bit. If anyone has any recommendations as to how to catch shit. Is this it? I would be totally down to hear those recommendations, assuming I don't catch it right here. I think this is it. Oh my gosh. This fishing bar size helps a lot, but I honestly think the other one would help even more. That decrease the drop rate when you're not on it. Oh my gosh. Yeah, if anyone has any tips, please let me know. I'm going to keep at this for a little bit and... Oh, hopefully I don't have a, a heart attack. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Uh, that is the most frustrating fishing I think I've done in this game. Holy moly, that's not fun. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure it would be if I ended up catching a fish. But my goodness, it's so difficult. Like, there's almost not skill involved. It's just the luck of, is it going to land where you think it's going to or not? Like... Oh boy, sorry, I don't mean to just complain, but oh my gosh, that's hard. Uh, I definitely do think the other piece of tackle I was talking about would be more beneficial. The one that allows you to, uh, or decreases the rate that it, your fishing progress decreases when you're not actively catching it. I think that would be a huge help, uh, but oh man. Okay, done talking about it. That was just, whew, deep breath. Okay, so... For the rest of our time today, I don't think we have time to go mining, which is unfortunate. Uh, and Pierre's closed, which is something I was wanting to do. But if we sell some of the... Uh, just kidding, Wheelie's closed too. I was going to say, if we sell some of these fish, I'd like to go down into the sewers and pay a visit to Krobus. I think that was his name. And uh, see if we can't get a void egg, just so we have one on hand for whenever uh, our... I think it's a duck egg we have hatching whenever that hatches uh but anyway we need to find sebastian i was about to call him vincent and then pierre came to my i don't know we need to find sebastian hopefully he's out i don't think he's at the bar uh we're gonna run by the saloon real quick just to see but i'm gonna go check by the mountain lake and see if he's out there smoking a cig as he's want to do but all right, let me go ahead and talk to people here and gift away, and then I will see if we can't find him. Ah, yes, here he is. Sebastian, happy birthday, bud. You remember my birthday? I'm impressed. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. And the heart, that must be one of his favorite gifts. Sebastian seems lost in thought. Cool. I'm so glad we found him, and I'm so glad he came out of his room. That would have been pretty garbage had he not. But while we're up here... And we have a lot of time left to kill, and it's really not enough time to do much of anything. Um, I'm not going to fish, that's for sure, but let's go check the quarry. We haven't been there in a couple days, and I want to see if there's any new gemstones that have appeared. I know there's always going to be just a ton of rocks that spawn, uh, but one thing I might... Ooh. I was going to say, one thing I might eventually do is... What? We might do this tonight, too. Um, one thing you can do over here is put stuff. So we could fill this with bee, ho bee houses and just make a ton of money. I don't know if I'll do that. But we need to bring a maple syrup to... Uh, at first glance, I see copper and that's it. So not worth my time. If we have a maple syrup, which I'm not sure we do, let's, let's go do that. I don't know what the heck that is. It said if you have maple syrup... Uh, or whatever. 
if you can read this, please come to the secret woods. Please bring maple, maple syrup or something like that. So yeah, let's check and see if we do. I don't think we do, but if we do, that'd be cool to do. Man, I'm saying the word do a lot. <laughs> Sorry about that. All right, let's go check and see if we have any maple syrup. Just as I suspected, we do not, unfortunately, but that's okay. We'll do it soon, hopefully. I don't think that's, I mean, all these secret notes, none of them are, yeah, it's not come to the secret woods tonight, but just by the, the text there, I'm going to guess we get a hat from that. I don't know. It seems like it's written by the, the hat mouse, but are any of these harvestable yet? No, nothing. Nothing at all. Oh my gosh. I don't know why I'm just now remembering of it. Remembering this. Um something in the beta. Why haven't we done this yet? Uh you can put hats on your horse. So let's grab the only two other hats we have. And let's I don't know how this works, but maybe just try right clicking. That's awesome. Oh yeah. The fedora. Applejack, you stud. That's so cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's awesome. Yes, I don't know why we haven't done that yet. That's so cool. Oh, all right. Next episode, when we... I mentioned we were going to do it this episode, but I totally forgot. And today is Wednesday, so I didn't even have a chance once I remembered. Uh, we need to start checking Pierre's again for... Or not again. Start checking Pierre's to begin with for new wallpaper for our interior of our house. It's absolutely hideous, and it's starting to drive me nuts. So we're going to fix it. We're going to fix it. I'm going to spend the rest of my time and energy cutting some hardwood, and we will head to bed right after this. Okay, let's go to bed. Also, that secret note we found gave us a quest. You found a note barely legible asking you to bring maple syrup to the secret woods. <laughs> I love the spelling of all that. It's absolutely atrocious. But we'll be doing that as soon as we get some maple syrup. But we kind of just have to play the waiting game for that. Oh, man. We're slowly making money. I wish we were making more. I feel like we need to be stockpiling a lot more gold come spring because of all the seeds we're going to be buying. And I don't know. But hopefully spring is going to be just ridiculously profitable. We're going to have a ton of crops. Hopefully accompanying iridium sprinklers with those crops we've got fruit trees we'll have even more animals by then it's just going to be profitable all around but all right guys that's going to do it for this one thank you very much for watching i'll see you in the next one and until then as always take care <laughs> <laughs>